gosh. Here we go again. Mm-mm-mm. When when I think about all the things that's going on in the world, man, when people who actually know each other actually get into beefs or any type of, you know, any type of discord, you know, you, you're looking as a person, you're looking at something that makes sense. And when you don't make sense, you kind of like, mm, is this for attention? Like, what is this is about, really? So it's nothing really interesting about about Meek Mill and Trey Songz. That's the, I'm sorry. Now, in case you you know. You was bored yesterday and <laughs> you got a life and wasn't caring about none of this stuff. Meek Mill comes back after Trey Songs says and asks him to donate to some charity foundation he had going on. You know, um, it's just so much nonsense you know it's just it's like really this is what blows people up now it's like come on it's not even like that oh my god it's It's just, it's something really goofy. And I'm just so blown away from it, you know. Trey Songz is trying to build up a doggone challenge with Meek Mill for charity. Where they donate money and, you know, they all donate to this, uh, uh, some type of, you know, charity foundation, and Meek Mill took it as if, you know, he's coming at me type of thing, and away it went, you know, and it just got sillier after that, and Meek was like, nah, I didn't try to, to put on the spot and come at me sideways and all that stuff, and it's like, like, Dude, y'all know each other. You know what I'm saying? It's like so stupid. And everybody's like, dog, you gotta talk about the the beef between. I'm like, it ain't no beef, dude. Like, they, these dudes know each other. You know, it's just it's just silly. And I ain't even wanna make this video because I'm like thinking of it to myself and I'm saying, man, this is like real dumb. So Look, I understand people want to compete and do this, but when people energy ain't right and they, you know, they grew up in an area where they think everybody's trying to come after them, you know, Meek had to show he donated 200K to Philly schools and put up his car and all this stuff. He helped raise 50 million for prison reforms and all this stuff. He was like, don't try me. Don't try me like that. Ain't no such thing as being real as people that's trying to use you. I'm like, wow. It just, it drives me crazy, man, because it's just silly. Even, even Trey was like, dude, I'm not even trying to, like, entice you in some type of beef like like what's wrong with you <laughs> you know like really is this what you thought like when you saw me is this the attitude you thought 
or the energy because it clearly wasn't the case <coughs> I mean, clearly wasn't. Prime example. Meek Mill likes to brag on what he does. You know, Trey Song got this uh, Feed Your City. Meek Mill's like, I donated two mil this year. Where you at? And, and he's laughing. And I'm like, dude, this ain't funny. You know what I'm saying? Doing something for charity is for charity. It ain't something that you bragging and throwing shots at on other people online. You know, that's what this is what people who donate money stay quiet. I've donated money to charity every year. I don't gotta prove that to nobody. It'd be people like, yo, what you doing though? So you know, like they doing something. I don't push people to, hey, man, y'all got to do this, y'all got to do that. No, you do because you want to do. If you don't want to do, that's on you. Me, I want to do, so I do. So that's how that works. So Trey acts like a victim. Like, he really, like, apparently, you know, me felt, apparently felt some way about challenging him to the Feed Your City Challenge. He felt the need to tell me what he's already done, hopefully not realizing I tapped on him because of how much I know he's already doing for his community. That's great. You donated, fam. That's great. You helping prison reform. That's great. You gave your phantom up. I'm simply trying to bring us together to further help the community. You offended? <laughs> you got it? He's like, nah, I didn't. Uh, don't try to put me on the spot with that sideways it. That's not even no money. Like four racks, other artists telling artists to donate is dumb. Just handle your business. Don't try to put me on the spot. This behavior kind of a new artist don't. Speaking on my money. Couldn't, you know, you could have kept this in the comments, bro. I just ain't feel your comment. No big deal. Trey was like, I hit your phone, both numbers, I got, and I sent you a DM. It's a challenge, Negro. Same way I challenged Mustard, Fab, Trouble, and they all accepted. We ain't even supposed to be at no kind of odds about giving back. This, it is pretty goofy, which it is. The whole thing is goofy. But my thing is, sometimes a comment, like me, I take things differently. I wouldn't even have responded back. If I'm Trey, you know, but these guys got egos, man, and their egos are so huge because they thinking, oh, my public, my brand. I've, I've seen YouTubers act like this. My brand got offended. You offended my brand. I'm like, nigga, you on YouTube. <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? <laughs> Yo, brand. Wait, like, man, get out my face. Man, there's so many like silly people in the world, man. It's it, you you will be shot. So then Meek, after realizing, you know, talking with Jay, Jay be like, Yo, what's what what are you doing right now? You arguing about charity? If you don't want to be a part of something, just, you know, don't be a part of nothing. That's it. You ain't got to explain nothing else. You're making yourself look bad out there. You know, all this stuff you're doing, you're talking about prison reform and all that. You know, it's almost like you bragging. You're making yourself, do you see me out there commenting on Twitter and arguing with, with, with people like that back and forth? Nah, because I ain't got the time. I'm too busy doing the work. What you got to do, man? Do, do it look like I got $5 in my pocket? No, it look like I gave it all to charity, right? That's the way you're supposed to be me. Don't look at me. I look very unhappy. <laughs> but I'm not. <laughs> so now then he comes back like, 
Oh, everybody, me and Trey bros. <laughs> you know, that's that's, that's not bro. He said that he's like that little threw me, you know, that threw me off low. That threw me off a little bit. That's all. So he's trying to talk it back and everything else. So that's that. <laughs> and hopefully we never ever 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 have to talk about Meek Mill and Trey Songs in this fashion ever again. Ever again. Now, on the plus side, let's talk about his little standstill off with old, what's his name? The big guy, the fat good dude that, that be working with, uh, what's his name? The snitch guy with the rainbow hair. Yeah, that dude, right? You know, he keeps playing with me. Like, he back in there. Oh, now you telling me keep your name out your mouth and all this. But first, you wanted me to talk about you. Now I'm talking about you. Now, yeah, I mean, just, just leave it alone, man. Like, really, it's, it's like, y'all think, you know, he thinks it's a game. And like he's saying, it'll be four years from now. He going to be just chilling on a na nice sunny day. Walking outside thinking of what thing he finna troll on or what new video game. And right outside of a game stop, he gonna stop up to pick up something he ordered and crack. Oh, there goes a two. There goes another two. There goes another two. And at that point, he gonna realize maybe four years earlier, he should have left Meek Mill alone. <laughs> <laughs> It'll be at that moment is when he realized he probably should have left Meek alone. I mean, do you see me talking about Meek? Me and Meek came to an understanding with his team, and we were all good. So on my standings, everything was everything. We was all good. And everything stopped. There was no need to continue on. We both came, we both realized we had a much deeper problem that had nothing to do with either one of us, and what we were doing was just silly. So that was that. I don't know what everybody else's deal is. So other than that, <laughs> I'm out. Don't forget to subscribe to the page, hit that like button, and Oh, yeah. Patreon's pretty good today, ain't it? <laughs> what I tell you? I'm going to have a state trying to call me today. Told you they ain't going to like this. 